Hello, I'm a programmer. This is Reed Kim. Are you enjoying programming? Well, I'm enjoying with f i v t u i I will show you example for Firebase with database. Firebase is free with many functions, but I will show you one of them that is database. I already completed the project, so I want to show what I made. Add data to database server in Firebase. Something like that. I use the text field. And change data. Click data. And add text. And swipe the list to delete. And delete in the server. And if the change data in server, the IO simulator automatically change data. Let's see how, how it works. First of all, you have to download uh, this code from GitHub. Click this one and download the zip. And open the finder and unzip the file. And one more thing open the terminal, you have to install POD. So move the directory. Where the project cd spacebar and directory and pod install and enter. And using xc workspace, yeah, you have to use it. And go to the Firebase ring and make a new project if you are first time to make the project. The name I made. Firebase DB test? No, just Firebase DB. And continue. And continue as well. And make the Google Ad Anal Analytic checkbox. And next. Wait a few minutes. You will make your project. Select project. And you have to setting something. As iOS project, so click this one and put project setting and click iOS button in the bottom and the bundle ID from Xcode right here. So copy and paste it and register app and download the config file. It's really important. Download it and add it to Xcode project. We already finished POD install and I already did it, so pass it, pass these things. And make database. Click database button and click database. And next. And select the server location. I just done but. So here we go. And you have to change the permission. It's fair. I will change it to true. And open the Xcode. If there is exist config file, delete it. And add a new config file. Something like that. Finish. Okay. It's done. Let's see the code. Firebase Swift. So I import the file Firebase and Firebase Firestore. And DB collection is for database collection. It's kind of a schema name. Yeah, right here. Maybe a uh, table name. And Firebase data is the class Firebase data. I use observer object to change data and the data type right here ID and message. So if each init, I will read the data first. And the great data, I need the text. So I made the message. And as make the like dictionary because of two data. So ID is just default to document document ID. And text 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 is the message. 
and read data, it's really real-time data from a VTN server and uh, iOS. So I, I used to add a, snap, a snapshot listener and each time a different action. If you add some data, just add data to array and to server. If it's modified, just change it. Add delete data using index and data. Get data and which, da uh, which you want to delete data and insert it. That's it. If the result is a success, uh, remove data from array. And update data, need ID and new text. Here is main view. First view, each list. Just show each the data array list first. If click data, get some option and on data is just swipe swipe for action. Enter the text to show update data or not. And last view just text field to change or get data. Do it but yeah, it's do it but if you need update, update it, otherwise add data. That's everything. You can download call the ring, the bottom, and please subscribe and like it.